creepy. Meg panics as rare films shows are throwing blanket at staff and screams at them every 10 minutes. Meghan Markle had persistently phoned one staff member from the royal household every 10 minutes, while she and Prince Harry were out for dinner, it's been claimed in the Times. The Duchess of Sussex felt like she'd been let down about an issue apparently worrying her, so had repeatedly contacted the royal staffer while the couple were out for dinner on Friday evening, the worker claimed. Valentine Lowe, author of Courtiers, The Hidden Power Behind the Crown, spoke to members of the royal household about the couple's relationship with their staff. In an extract from the book published in the Times, one worker was quoted saying, Every ten minutes I had to go outside to be screamed at by Meghan and Harry. The worker recalled the conversation, saying the back and forth continued for a number of days, at all times of day and night. They added, It was, I can't believe you've done this, you've let me down, what were you thinking? It comes as further problems were reported between the couple and the Queen's long-established dresser, Angela Kelly. Prior to a wedding to Harry, the Duchess had been told the Queen would lend her a tiara for the big day, as she had done for Kate during her wedding to Prince William. But Miss Kelly wasn't available the same day Meghan's hairdresser was, so neither was the tiara. This meant Meghan wasn't given an opportunity to rehearse with the tiara before the day of the wedding, and this in Harry's view was Miss Kelly being obstructive, the book claimed. Angela Kelly reportedly ignored repeated requests from Kensington Palace to arrange a date for the hair trial, according to the Sussex's unofficial biography, Finding Freedom, Harry and Meghan and the Making of a Modern Royal Family. Author Omid Scobie wrote, Nothing could convince Harry that some of the old guard at the palace simply didn't like Meghan and would stop at nothing to make her life difficult. It comes after Meghan was previously accused of bullying staff members during a time as a working royal, which she'd always denied. In other news, Prince Harry and his wife Meghan Markle have been accused of making fun of the late Queen's wish by filming a scene of their docuseries in one of the private residences of the royal family. The Spectator's Cara Kennedy says the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, who are constantly complaining about privacy, actually went against Queen Elizabeth's words to attract audience with their show. Lilibet and Archie's parents were seen drinking tea inside the Queen's private cottage in the controversial Netflix series. This couple, who constantly complain about privacy and how they just want a private life, actually went against the Queen's word, who said you will not film inside my private residences, Miss Kennedy claimed. Harry and Meghan's documentary has seemingly backfired in the UK and the US, as the majority of Americans and Britons slammed the couple for their repeated claims and their self-promoting stunts in the show.